Uh, excuse me, ladies and gentlemen, I, I normally wouldn't bring my phone on stage, but I was asked to read this verbatim. My name is Brian McBride. You may know me as the voice of Syracuse on the Creep Off podcast. Yeah! Vinny Paulino has asked me to come here tonight to introduce the comedy debut of his, of his Creep Off co-host, Carl Hamburger. The jokes that Mr. Hamburger is about to perform are very offensive. Please be advised that this type of humor is not endorsed by the people's champion, Vinnie Paulino. If you feel offended by anything that he says this evening, please feel free to film it and report it to the hypocrisy police by tweeting at Stuttering John M. Thank you for your attention. We hope to give you, we hope you enjoy the show tonight. Now please give a warm round of applause for Carl Hamburger. Thank you, Brian McBride. <laughs> All right, I'm just going to, look at guys, this is my consequence. I'm just going to read the jokes as they were written. Boy, is Vinny fat. Vinny looks like Stuttering John if Stutcho let himself go. <laughs> All right, I'm, I'm going to do the actual jokes now. That was, that was for me. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? Banana. Yeah. Knock, knock. Who's there? Banana. Yeah. Knock, knock. Who's there? Orange. Orange. Oh, no. Orange, you glad I didn't say banana again. <laughs> Hamburger. <laughs> I unfrosted my tips, sir. Please do not interact with the performers during the show. This is, is this thing on? How much do pirates pay for corn? A buccaneer. Hamburger. Speaking of football, how about a round of applause to the Kansas City Chiefs for winning the Super Bowl? I'm so happy for Tay-Tay, but you know me, I just love a good love story. <laughs> How about those 49ers? Though they really looked like Stuttering John's kids during the Super Bowl. <laughs> hey, Amber. What's the difference between a Bills fan and a baby? The baby will stop whining after a while. Hamburger. <laughs> That's enough about a football. Let's talk about something I know a lot about, gay dudes and teeth. <laughs> so this is the setup. It's the setup. What do you call a gay dentist? A tooth fairy. Hamburger. <laughs> so now, now I'm getting into the ones I think Cardiff actually wrote. <laughs> Why did Katie Holmes divorce Tom Cruise? Because she saw him in A Few Good Men. <laughs> hey, Amber. I feel sorry for Catholic gays this time of year. No meat on Fridays must suck for them. Not me, though. I'm a dick-sucking atheist. <laughs> hey, Amber. A gay guy, a lesbian, and a transgender we are all lined up to go to a ween concert. The bouncer came out and asked them to get into a straight line, so they left. Oh. So many details in this. Hey, Amber! <laughs> what did the necrophiliac say when he was walking by the morgue? I'm gonna stop in for a cold one. Hey, Amber! <laughs> how did, how do you get a nun pregnant? You come in her cunt. Hamburger. I want to thank my mom for being here, my dad. Great to see you both. I don't get it. What's the difference between a tire and a bag of 365 used condoms? One's a good year, the other's a great all you can eat buffet. Hamburger. What's the difference between a chickpea and a lentil? 
I've never paid $100 for a lentil in my mouth. <laughs> hey, Amber! <laughs> I was recently arrested after an isotopes gig. Allegedly, I was fingering a minor. <laughs> While I was being arrested, the cop read me my rights and said, anything I say can and will be held against me. So I yelled, Cox! <laughs> Pam Burger. <laughs> that, I liked that one, too. <laughs> I thought that was funny. <laughs> I was reading these right, right before we came over here. I was like, that's not bad. <clears throat> I came home from shopping at Wegmans yesterday, and my wife asked, how was Wegmans? I said, it's funny that you ask. Something strange happened. A guy in the produce department showed me his dick. My wife was shocked, but her curiosity got the best of her. She said, what was it like? I said, it reminded me of a peanut. She started laughing and said, it's tiny like yours? <laughs> I said, no, it was huge. It was just very salty. Pam Burke. Why does Sam Adams come in bottles and cans? Because his wife is a frigid cunt. Pam Burger. <laughs> okay, Jesus Christ. What's the deal with illegal immigrants? Am I right? They show up here raping and stealing. Everyone is on such high alert now. It makes it so much harder for us rapists that were born here. <laughs> Hamburger. <laughs> Guys, that's been my time. Thank you all for coming to the show.